Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I do budgeting videos and debt snowball updates. I also do fitness and competition videos. So if that's something you're interested in, don't forget to click the subscribe button and like this video. In today's video, I will be doing my cash envelopes. I know every, the past two months I've been saying that I was going to do my cash envelopes and I never get around to them because I, I just never go by the bank. So today I went on my lunch break because I really want to give um, just spending cash on some categories such as groceries, um, my mis miscellaneous spending such as just getting things for what I need around the house like tissue and paper towels and things like that. And I also did an envelope for um, eating out so if me and Trey want to go get some a bite to eat real quick then I have um, a specific envelope for that as well so yeah this month I'm just starting out with a few I think I have let's see four envelopes and stuff this month so, so nothing let's fancy. get right into it um, I think maybe next month if I stick to these then I'll go and I might purchase um, some cute little cash envelopes from like someone's Etsy shop because I follow I follow a couple people that do make um, some cuter cash envelopes, but I just did these for myself this month. So, all right. And I wrote down what I would put in each. I'm going to get the cash out. And I didn't specify what bills I wanted when I went. Let me close this up. When I went to the bank today. So. She gave me a little bit of everything. So for groceries, I had already spent um, about seventy or so dollars um, at the bank at the bank <laughs> at the grocery store on Sunday to get a few groceries for the week. So today I'm just gonna stuff this envelope with one hundred and sixty dollars. So we're gonna do a hundred, two, four, six. And that'll go for my groceries. So, 100, 2, 4, and 6 will go in my grocery envelope. Okay. And then for eating out, I did 40. So 40. Y'all don't pick at my little decorative envelopes I did. Just a little something. I'm not the most creative person. And then car maintenance, because I do at least like to get my car washed. And I also know I have an oil change coming up. So I'm going to add $50 for um, car maintenance. Because my oil change is usually around about $40. I usually find a coupon for it. And then washing my car next week, I usually spend $10. So that's what we're going to put. And then miscellaneous, I did 40. There's 20, 30, 35, and 40. And this is my little miscellaneous envelope. <laughs> so, put that in there. So, these are the four I'm going to start with. I think her, what's, I think her name is. Uh, I'm gonna have to put a name on the screen, but I know she was giving tips about how to start your cash envelopes, and she was saying don't try and start out with too many. Just start out with a few where you know you overspend, and groceries and eating out is my the two categories that I overspend in, so I really want to keep track of those, and then not mixing up like the things I get from my household with my grocery money. So that's what I'm gonna do this month. I also want to clarify in my um budgeting video I had put that um next week's paycheck will pay for the um next week this. paycheck would pay for um my bills that I had coming up so like my student loans my credit card and um, my electric and utility or well, my utilities bill but that was incorrect this the paycheck that I got last week will be covering those expenses and then the check that I get next week will cover um, my rent for the upcoming month and also my um, internet um, bill so 
just wanted to clarify that i will update you guys in the next video because i plan on doing paycheck to paycheck videos now because i want to split it up and try and keep track that way and also because i'm doing my cash envelopes and i want to um split those up bi-weekly so yeah guys that is going to conclude this video i just wanted to come on and show you all my cash envelopes and hold myself accountable and show you guys that i'm finally going to try using cash and sticking to my cash envelopes so um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please click the like button. And also, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already a part of the family. I will check in with you guys next time. Bye.